What is up guys, welcome into a brand new video. Now today we are going to be reacting to some of the new content that Big Ant have just put out about Cricket24, very excited. The only thing that's annoyed me is that it's kind of dropped to like 5 o'clock in the morning my time, so it's now 20 to 8 that I'm recording this video. I've just woken up, we're going to get straight into it. Guys, before we do, if you could leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't already. I am really excited for Cricket24 now, I cannot wait. I have not seen this video um, so this is going to be the content that we're going to be receiving. So we're going to have day one, which is the today, which is we've got the dev diary video. I think it's about a minute and a half long, something like that. We're going to be reacting to that. Day two, we get some screenshots tomorrow. Uh, day three, we get a teaser video. Uh, so that's going to be on Wednesday and some more screenshots. And then obviously day four, I don't even know if we'll watch the trailer. We'll have the game. There'll be gameplay being uploaded. But let's have a look at this video. Apparently there is some uh, gameplay stuff, some new licensing stuff um and we'll have a look and see what's happening all right okay let's see what this is, is the most heavily all right ross game. we spent years going around the world signing up the nation from the majors to the it, uh... for the first time ever a cricket game goes global okay so we finally got indian calendar so one minute you're playing the caribbean so that's the calendar We'll probably we'll watch it at the start and then we'll uh, we'll react to some of the things. And then maybe time to start it all over again. That looks similar. All these licenses in Korea is it allows the have to admit really experience each different format that you can have within the sport. You've got your England, Australia, West Indies, New Zealand. Okay, the graphics look a little bit better. The player profiles look better. I like the menus. I like the, I like the black and the green. It looks like the Fox Cricket. Do like it. Number of new licensed equipment. So we've got even more bat manufacturers. Nice. Pads, gloves, helmets. So along with the animations that are also associated with those players, it really does make it feel like new bats. Real life person that's actually in there. Do like it. Kate Cross was that? Look like it. When you license a, a real cricketer and you get them for real in the game, it makes for a real experience. So have they done, have they done the, the photo, I don't know, we'll have a look. All of our previous games and others previous games is the depth and authenticity. It is the most licensed cricket game ever. Okay, so basically we got, the whole time was just talked about licenses. Um, so let's see if we can kind of go back and get some screenshots here. So, oh, let's start that again. So this looks similar. This pretty much looks the same as it always is. Which worries me. That looks a lot like a 22 reskin. That looks good though. I think that's the CPL. Um, CPL. What's the word I'm looking for? Shirts. They look good. Uh, Rashi Khan looks good. Um, I think in the... Gujra, yeah, he's in. He's in, he, okay. So the IPL kits are in. Titans are one of the teams we knew that already. That looks like the Mumbai Indians, I think. Kit uh, Sydney Creek Round again looks good. The crowd looks a bit better, I'd say this year. Um, this looks like the same as it is last year. The menus look really good. So obviously this is the this is the calendar that we get in career mode. Um. So that actually looks a lot better, but I think it has just changed the colour. Um, I don't know why they haven't full screened. Um, that's really annoying. Um, can we not full screen on your computer? Um, so that looks good. Rossi's beard looks good. Uh, yeah, there we go. That's the Mumbai Indians top. That is... I can't remember who David Warner plays in the IPL now. Who does he play for in the IPL? Oh, I don't know. Who knows? um okay so the 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 kind of the actual screen is the same we don't have the big bash um what's the word um kind of graphics which i guess was kind of expected um again the bowling looks similar i can't see that they're adding anything else it's just after touch timing um so that's fine the toss looks the same um again i like that looks a bit bolder and a bit clearer than it was before um 
England vs Australia again it, the same graphics looks like the same umpires they still haven't fixed the, the hundred it should be going up the sides of the screen and I, I feel like they should do that I don't understand why they don't um, it is what it is uh, this is the player profile um, so New Zealand are definitely in it I don't think I can't remember if they were if all of their kits and stuff was were uh, licensed last year but they are this year uh, that loading screen looks good um, Australia an 85 overall Ireland only a 70 I wonder what England would be oh who else we get New Zealand 83 so England have got to be 84 surely Oman 64 so the new pads look good you can't really see it uh, so that looks good from the front I don't know if that's a photo or what I like the detail of where they've kind of put the, the dust on the uh, on the pad that looks a lot better um, yeah and then it's just gloves it's breaking it down player profiles that we don't really need to see it does look better than last year the players I have to admit um, and it's, I know they struggled with uh, with COVID getting people in to do all the photometric things or whatever that they do um, so that'll be interesting again I don't know if we've seen the fire running out before um, but that's definitely interesting no sponsors on the stars kit is there usually a sponsor on there I thought there would be something on the front but I think that is everything so we've got absolutely nothing about gameplay um, or anything like that okay so, so I'm just slightly worried I guess I mean uh, it looks very 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 similar to Cricket 22 like incredibly similar um the, the, it, the, the kind of players in it do look a lot better um, than they did last year but that was kind of going to happen because we know that they could get them in to do the, the all the kind of stuff that they need to actually do like a player game phase um, rather than just building them from scratch um, so I don't know I, I mean let us know down in the comments what you think I think this is going to be I think it's going to be great I think it's going to be made by the gameplay and how smooth it feels um, not how it looks um, and how many kind of different things that we're going to get but at the moment i don't know if they're going to if there's anything in the mechanics that has changed but from just the graphics it looks like a cricket 22 reskin um it doesn't look like a lot has changed i might be completely wrong but graphics wise and everything that we just saw in that video is a cricket 22 reskin um the graphics haven't changed okay you get the the menus look a bit better but that's about it. I was expecting new graphics. I was expecting the game to look a little bit crisper. Um, at the moment, I mean, I'm, I know that we're just looking at it on basically someone's computer screen. Um, so it's probably not the best thing to look at. But I am a little bit worried. Um, but that is going to be it. Guys, we're going to be back tomorrow. A very similar time tomorrow with the reaction to the screenshots. Hopefully we can kind of get a bit of better idea um hopefully they'll throw a couple of gameplay stuff in there um so basically screenshots of the menu what's going to be available from launch um and then obviously wednesday we'll be back with um a teaser video and some more screenshots and then thursday we are going to be smashing out cricket 24 content all the time on this channel so make sure you subscribe um, make sure you turn that bell notification on to get a notification every time we upload here we're going to have hopefully pro team on the thursday we're also going to have career mode starting on the thursday um we're also going to be live on twitch on thursday so i'm very excited about that um but guys that's gonna be it for today's video i very much hope you enjoyed it um and i'll see you in the next one cheers